I might gain Christ. I wanted to look at verse 9. It says, and that I may actually be found and known as in him. Jesus said, be in me. So he says, that when you look for me, find me in him. <laughs> oh, isn't that awesome? Oh, so that even you look for me that I might be found as in him, not having any self-achieved righteousness that can be called my own based on my obedience to the law, but possessing that genuine righteousness which comes through faith in Christ, the anointed one, the truly right standing with God, which comes from God by saving faith. Now hear what he says in verse 10. Now, now he had a purpose. Okay, every single one of us must have a purpose in our lives. We must have a vision. We must be on our way somewhere. Amen. If you, are, if you are trying to be the best Christian you are, you are not going anywhere. I can promise you that. If you try and be the best Christian possible, you are not moving in a direction. You are moving around the mountain over and over again. Because one day you will be good, the next day you will be bad. You are busy the whole time. That's what the devil wants. He wants to keep you busy. So you, can, you, you cannot receive the, the true and genuine vision that God has given every single one of us on this earth. It is to be like Christ. Now, now, now Paul here says, here what he says, For my de the determined purpose is, now when you say my, say my as if for yourself, amen? For my determined purpose is that I may know him. Oof. That I may progressively become more deeply and intimately acquainted with Him. Perceiving and recognizing and understanding the wonders of His person more clearly and you know, more strongly and more clearly. And that I may in the same way come to know the power outflowing from His resurrection, which it exerts over believers. And that I may so share His sufferings as to be continually transformed into in spirit into his likeness even to his death in the hope that if if possible i may attain the spiritual and mortal resurrection while well, i'm even still in the body <laughs> you think paul but you you are somebody who must have known jesus you spend time with jesus don't you know him i know that every time he must have looked at Jesus. every time that he must have spoken to jesus he must have realized i want to know him Oh man, I want to know this man, this person, Jesus Christ. I want to know him more strongly and more deeply. He said, that is my purpose. He, snakes bit him, he survived. You know, they couldn't kill him. This man saw everything. And he says, the only thing I want, the only thing I desire is to know Jesus. He was really born again. This was really a man who knew him. But at the end of everything, everything taken up together, he says, the only thing I still desire on this earth is just to know Jesus. You know, when did we lose that passion of just knowing Jesus? You know, and that's what I spoke to the people about in Botswana as well. We get so used to church or the, or the, the, the religious idea of church. When we worship, you know, we want to feel excited, you know, bless me, Lord. But I don't just want to be blessed. I want to know the blesser. I want to know the one who bless. I don't just want to be given everything I need. I want to know the one who gives. Amen. I want to experience him. I want to feel him. And many times it happened. And the times he touched me, I couldn't stay the same. I could no longer be the same person. Because he revealed himself to me. And Jesus is revealing himself to us every day through the word, through praise and worship songs, you know, through things that happen in your life. He's revealing who he is to you every single day. But we have to recognize him. Amen. We have to know, hey, the same man, this is Jesus speaking to me right now. Let me learn his voice. Let, me, let him teach me everything that I need to know. I'm not going to share anything else. That is, that is what I want to share today. It's all about Jesus. I don't want any other lovers I don't want any other lovers I don't want any other lovers Sing with me I don't want any other lovers Again Cause I don't want Hailly other lovers No, I don't want any other lovers 
No, I don't want any other lovers. No, I don't want any other lovers. Cause you can take it all, take it all. Just give me Jesus. Just give me Jesus. Cause you can take it all. Take it all, just give me Jesus, just give me Jesus, oh, you can take it all, take it all, just give me Jesus, just give me Jesus, and you can take it all, take it all. Just give me Jesus, just give me Jesus. It's all of my devotion belongs to this man. It's all of my devotion belongs to this man. All of my devotion belongs, belongs to this man. All of my devotion belongs to this man. You can take, you can take it all, take it all. Give me Jesus, just give me Jesus, and you can take it all, take it all, and just give me Jesus, just give me Jesus, and you can take it all, take it all, just give me Jesus. Just give me Jesus. You can take it all, take it all. But just give me Jesus. Just give me Jesus. I don't want, I don't want any other lovers. No, I don't want any other lovers. I don't want any other lovers No, I don't want any other lovers Let's sing it for No, I don't want any other lovers Jesus, I don't want any other lovers I don't want any other lovers I don't want I only I only want you Jesus Cause you can take it all take it all and just give me Jesus just give me Jesus Cause you can take it all take it all just give me Jesus, oh, just give me, just give me Jesus, and you can take it all, take it all, and just give me Jesus, and just give me Jesus, and you can take it all, take it all, just give me Jesus. Just give me Jesus There's all of my devotion And belongs to this 